much this means to you and if you give it up now you're gonna regret it what that's him where right there the pull off pull, pull off okay i'm pulling off shit So you leaving because of me or because you can't go in? I waited on you to show a few times. Why? So you could see me on stage. What? Well, Cal, I figured it didn't make any sense to do a poem I wrote about you if you weren't there to hear me do it. Turn the car around. Well, Turn okay. around. Yeah. <laughs> this little lady broken hearted. So this little lady turns stone. Some little ladies Cupid darted. Some little ladies all alone. So this little lady goes wee, 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 all the way back to poem. And poem goes back to me, like spine to tummy. I come to you undefined, raw, full of flaw, buried alive like an unmarked, unwrapped, swaddled mummy, left behind a door, trapped inside a floorboard of a pyramid. My mama been telling me I need even more Lord than I did as a kid, cause now I'm in a game of hide and go seek with self. And I can't seem to remember where she hid. It's like I'm locked behind these 32 bars of this rhyme, like I'm serving a 32 year bid for my husband's crime. And he's still filthy, but I feel guilty. Like he done geppetto the Pinocchios out of my soul with blows to my nose. Now it's even hard to smell the rose that are right underneath my toes and doctors suppose I done lost my mind. Like the scarecrow, a scared crow, just crying at the beautiful death of a once beautiful love, now photographed perfectly and framed in a chalk outline. I am a prodigal dove. Just flying to find my way back home, and lately, old ladies been offering me ten pennies for my thoughts. I turn them into a dime and tell them it was because I loved him. That's the reason I didn't fight back. The more he fought each time, dear God, I swear I'm trying. Through ears scarred that are even becoming blind, it's getting hard to hear how this scene's supposed to play out. Imagine what it feels like to be kicked out of your own skin, razor thin, with razor thin sticks that are sprouting from my words. It hurts my mouth when I speak. But every time I write them in stone, it's like I'm hurting them. I am a poetess, broken, flirting with a pen that don't even like my hand. I am a dilapidated woe man, so woe man, woe. You gotta handle me with care. Can't you see I got empty rooms inside of here? And filled with dirt on my walls, though frantically and patiently, I still sit next to a broken phone awaiting God's call. This poem wasn't written to be tall and handsome, but I'm admitting that it's dark, full of callous fists that beat me and beat me and beat me until my heart split. So if this here be Woman's Anonymous, hello. I am the wife of a piece of shit. And on the side, I've been dating Satan, and that motherfucker got me hating my life. 
and got me thinking there's got to be more to the stage than an encore of rage. So, dear God, please, please let me in on your secret on how a beautiful but broken bird can still sing when she's locked underneath the cage. And all she ever dreamed of was to find the love worthy of her pen and her page. Peace to my beautiful daughter. Peace be with her. May God watch over her. to thrive.